My name is Thomas Lewis, and today I'm going to talk about Cisco Intersight, which is a, a great product that we're leveraging within the cloud to attach all of our UCS uh, compute nodes, whether that's Hyperflux, whether it's standalone servers, or whether we're also dealing with uh, Fabric Interconnects with, uh, with Blades or C-Series attached. Uh, in this video, we're going to talk about a big problem that a lot of our customers are experiencing. And what that is, is hardware compatibility. Purchasing a UCS fabric over a period of time, we see a multitude of changes. One, the operating system that exists on our Blades or C-Series servers change over time. And then the internal workings or modules that are inside our C-Series or Blade servers change as well. We may get different types of memory, newer types of sockets, and this in turn changes what type of firmware or drivers we're leveraging to make sure that our operating system and our machines work together. In this case, we had something that we used in predecessors or time gone by called the UCS hardware compatibility matrix. And here you would have to go in and select your different type of server, the type of model, what type of processor and operating system you're using, and it would come out with the appropriate drivers that you would need to install on your system to ensure operability. This can change over a period of time and you start creating large Excel spreadsheets that, uh, that are very cumbersome to manage because of the size of your environment and also the different pieces that fit along within it. We've tried to fix that within Cisco Intersight. So as we come here, we can look at our dashboard and I can actually click on uh, different pieces. In this case, I'm gonna to go to my servers. And from within here, I have a search function and I can see all of my different nodes, but I can look at a multitude of different pieces. And in this case, I'm gonna select our uh, HX clusters. And this, I'm gonna select this final HX cluster and this is gonna bring me to all of the different nodes that I have within that Hyperflex environment. But from here, I can click on the actual node itself and I can start seeing some relevant information. Not only do I see all the different devices or modules or components that make up this server, but I have a tab over here for hardware compatibility. And if I click on this, I can come back to a new screen, which is gonna ask me to get the recommended drivers. So here I can click on this link, I can put in the appropriate vendor. And in this case, we'll select VMware and we'll say that the OS version is gonna be running on uh, we'll say update two. And now I have the list of drivers that I need to ensure this server works correctly. And I can simply click on the download driver ISO to go to our Cisco repository to get those drivers up and running and actually see a green light if everything's operating. Much easier to leverage than a spreadsheet and much easier to scale across your environment no matter what operating system or components reside in it. Thanks so much for your time.